Hey guys, this is a EWH online video lecture for joints, bones, muscles, and their movements. And the materials we're going to need today are a pair of scissors, a black sharpie, two large rubber bands, a little hand cutout, two little black rubber bands, three popsicle sticks with all cuts in them already, and a glue stick. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to want to do is put two popsicle sticks on top of each other and align them properly. Take one black rubber band and on this third cut, tape, um, wrap the rubber band around together on the two popsicle sticks. About four, four turns should do. The next thing we're going to do is take the third popsicle stick and place it on the opposite end in between the other two popsicle sticks and align them on that third cut right here again and rubber band all those three together about three times this time should do and basically what we're trying to simulate here are the three bones in your arm which is your radius, ulna, and your hemorrhoids. So the next thing we want to do is gonna, we're going to label this with our sharpie. Right here is the radius. Right here is your humerus. And the other side is your ulna. And I'm going to label the humerus again. So that right there is our labeling. All right, so what we're going to want to do next is simulate the muscles. So we're going to make a little loop-de-loop -loop here at the top of the hemorrhoids. And what I mean by that is literally take the two ends of the rubber band, go through, and pull it right here, if you can see that. And then we're going to take it and connect it at the bottom near the radius and the ulna double bone right there. So that right there um, is a simulation of our biceps and how they work. So pretty simple. And we're going to want to do the same thing for our triceps on the other hand. So we're going to make a loop-de-loop -loop on this side at the same spot at the top. We're going to pull through. And then attach it to the back of the radius and the ulna. And right there you have your biceps and your triceps. So we're talking about right here and the muscle movement out here. So you have your three bones and your two muscles. So next thing to kind of give the kids an idea of where the hand placement is, we're going to glue the hand right here on this side so that it makes it more visible that we're talking about the muscles and the bones of the arm. So we'll apply a little glue right there. And voila. So you have your arm and your simulation of the triceps and the biceps and you have the radius and the ulna. Alright, that's it for today. Thank you for watching.